Hello guys. In this video, we are going to discuss about how network impact by automation and programmability. Like how automation impact on networking. Like you are watching in this design, we have connected our routers and big data server, real server, honey ports and Python programming are also used in this. Okay, like why we use this concept because we have to detect hacker traffic and we have to launch Python script redirect flow. So basically what is the impact of automation on network? So let's discuss about this concept. Okay, so first of all, we need, we, we have to discuss about like network world is developing rapidly. Okay, like with these development, network requirements have increased and new methodologies are also developed to overcome this improvement. Okay, so we have so many improvement in our network, so that's why we have to work on that. So one of the technology that helps network world about network automation. Network automation, I have already told you that Python is added in our network. With network automation, what are the impact? In network automation, we have used uh, activities like network management, testing, deployment, configuring and various network operations. Okay, with the help of this network uh, automation technique, what are the benefit? We have reduced our operation cost. Okay, so our operation cost is reduced. Our times is higher, higher time up. After that, with the help of automation, our errors are low, like lower errors. Our staff is effective, our network control is better, our business agility is increased. Okay, so with the vision of network automation, you can develop new products and services that can improve your business agility and market share also. Okay, so this is the impact of network automation on our network. Now, we have to also discuss about like what are the basic difference between traditional networks and controller based networking. Like what are the difference that we have to work on that. So, I have some difference here. Like we have to work on the criteria like about tra uh, traditional network as well as our SDN, software defined networking. Okay, so in traditional network and SDN, what are the difference and what is the approach used by the network authorities? The approaches are like network management. Okay, so we have so many criteria: network management, global network view, maintenance cost. Okay, if we talk about network management, then in traditional network, it is difficult because changes are implemented separately for each device. I have my three labs and in three labs we have so many devices so for traditional network management is different uh, global network view is also difficult in traditional network maintenance cost is very high like if we have to update our network then it will take months like we don't have controller utilization we don't have uh, importance of authenticity integrity and consistency of controller okay so this thing is uh, common in traditional and SDN like integrity and consistency and availability of controller is not relevant and resource utilization is less. But in software defined networking, network management is very easy. Global network view is with the controller, maintenance cost is very less and time required for updates quite easy. Why? Because we have central controller in this. Okay. Uh, controller utilization is important. Authenticity and integrity part is same in traditional and SDN. Okay. But availability of controller is very important in SDN. Okay. So now uh, resource utilization is also high. So now we have to say like SDN is far better than our traditional network. So this is the great impact of automation on our network. Okay, so thank you so much about this topic. In our next video, we will discuss about so many automation topics. Thank you.